Hey guys, Carrie here, looking a little uneven. Um, can you guys guess what today's video is going to be about? It's not my lashes, but it's close. It is this baby right here. This is our Mood Struck Addiction Shadow Palette, and mine is covered in makeup because I use it every single day. This is number three, and this one is pinks, plums, um, some browns, and some blacks. So it's super, super versatile, and I love that it can give me more of a dramatic daytime look, kind of like what I have on now. Or you can go super, super smoky with this black, which is irate, or cheeky, which is the sparkly purple next to it, for a super like dramatic nighttime date look. So um, I'm happening, I somehow, by some crazy fluke, uh, my eye makeup turned out really good on my right eye, so I'm like, well, I gotta do my left eye, might as well film a video. So fingers crossed that um, it goes just as well. Let's dive right in. Um, I'm gonna start out, <clears throat> oh, I've already, I should go back here and say that I already have highlighted my brow bone with Smitten, which is this shade right here. Smitten, like a smitten kitten. Um, and I just use the deluxe brush and I'm just patting it along um, right underneath my brow there just to highlight it, highlight the arch of my brow, give it a nice, you know, little shimmer. So it's like an instant facelift. It's like your brows down here, you highlight, and it's like whoop, which is what you want. Now, I am going to take. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, determined, which is this brown, this really nice neutral brown right here. I'm going to put that all over my lid. Like I said, this is more of a, like a, a dramatic daytime look, obviously. Um, you could really, if you don't have a lot of time, you could stop right after this step, right after you highlight and um, fill in your lid, and it would still look really pretty. These pigments are so, or these pigments, this shadow is so pigmented that a, a little bit goes a really, really long way. Trust me. All right. Then I'm going to take Flippant, which is this guy right here, almost this silvery purple shade. That's going in my crease. Okay. I don't know why I make weird voices when I do videos. It's just... Now, I have hooded lids, so I have to do more of an exaggerated crease just to kind of lift my lid up a little bit so you can actually see the shadow that goes in my crease. So I over dramatize my, my crease. Um, how you can find yours is just find that between your eyeball and your brow bone and that's your crease, okay? And then just blend flippant in and then I like to blend it out just a little bit, okay? Use just a little bit more. Voila! Oh, that looked really bad. Don't do that. <laughs> um, okay, now I need to just blend just a little bit more. So I'm going to put a little bit more of Determined, that brown lid color. And I'm just going to put that right over. Okay. Now, what I had done over here, and I didn't really like it, but I'm going to try it again over here. We're just going to go with the flow and see how it looks. Um, I'm, I'm used a little bit of Cheeky, which is this um, silvery or this more the shimmery purple right here. Um, I used it a little bit in my crease and I didn't really like it so I really had to super super blend it out but we're going to try it again and I'm just using a little tiny bit and I'm just going to put it on the outside of that crease okay so I'm just going to kind of like 
blend it in. I'm going to start on the outside because I want to give my crease just a little bit of depth. So we're starting on the outside. We're just working our way in. And then I'm going to wipe off this brush and then I'm just going to blend it. Just because I feel like it needs a touch more drum off. Look at that, it worked. Bam. Okay, now if you need to, you can always go back in again with Determined and just, you know, put a little bit more on your lid if it feels like maybe it um, just needs a little bit of. I'll tell you what I forgot to do with here, too. All right, taking the deluxe brush again with Smitten, that highlighter color, and we're just going to do our tear ducts. do weird faces too. Taking our liner shadow brush and I'm taking Irate which is this matte black here and that's what I'm going to use for my liner. And I love using the um, the liner part of this brush because it really helps me to get that smoky effect that you just can't get with a pencil liner. So there you have it. Finish off with your 3D Fiber Plus so you get sky high lashes. And I also have pouty lip liner on my lips just because we're going drama, drama, drama right here. You need to keep it neutral right here. Thanks so much for tuning in, guys. I hope this helped. I will talk to you later. Bye.